Rolling off the assembly line in June of 1913 from the Baldwin Locomotive Works, the ACL 1031 was one of 25 such locomotives ordered by Atlantic Coastline at the time. Now these engines originally had the really cool nickname of Copperheads. It's because of a bright brass ring that surrounded the smokestack on each of those engines. Headquartered in Wilmington, North Carolina from 1900 to 1960, Atlantic Coastline was the only Class 1 railroad in North Carolina during that time. They used their engines for passenger and freight service from Wilmington to Rocky Mountain Fayetteville, points north to Virginia and south to Florida. As more efficient diesel locomotives swept in, steam locomotives were relegated to smaller subsidiaries. Now the 1031 was sent to the ACL on East Carolina Railway, based out of Tarboro in the mid-1950s. The engine was the last steam engine to operate on that line, ending steam operations there in April of 1957. After a short stint on the Virginia and Carolina Southern Railway based out of Lumberton, North Carolina, the 1031 was retired in 1959 and placed on display in Florence, South Carolina behind the passenger station adjacent to the rail yards. It stayed there for some 35 years until 1994 when the city of Florence donated the 1031 to the North Carolina History Commission, which became the North Carolina Transportation Museum Foundation. The engine was cosmetically restored here at the museum two years later in 1996. Now we mentioned that the ACL 1031 made the last run of steam on the East Carolina Railway in 1957. Now thanks to Tom Stallings we have this information. The fireman on that run was a Mr. George Hyman. Mr. Hyman passed away just this past April, 63 years to the month after that last run. So let this not just be a history of a steam locomotive, but also a tribute to Mr. Hyman and all those that spent their days in those steam locomotive cabs, smelling the smoke, sweating by the fireboxes, shoveling coal. They did the hard work to tie a nation together and to keep us moving. Continue to learn at home with other great videos from the North Carolina Transportation Museum on Facebook, YouTube, and nctrans.org. The North Carolina Transportation Museum in Spencer is the museum that moves you.